I just stopped by to show you this little intermediate college in the most unknown of places, the Vivekananda Intermediate College. Here. And there's a lot of monkey, presence of monkeys in the little town. This little tree with a lot of inflorescence, lovely, beautiful inflorescence around. The leaf is very thick, shiny, and with a solid texture, sort of ready to fold itself. The leaves are ready to fold themselves over. The road is not in the best of its, but still, this is what keeps most of the vehicles away and provides a good passage, good walk through, with a little bit of challenge here and there. You see the sun has set and the day is sharply coming over to an end. That's a Devdara tree with the tip broken off. And this is a beautiful house I must show you. This is an old traditional house. You can see it, the masonry is in stones and the windows are covered with the typical traditional window sills and new buildings coming up that's another by lane around so you see this little house with the quite artistically made out window frames well laid out symmetrically placed uh, stainless steel sheets gi sheets to prevent uh, water accumulation water goes down and is harvested through channels you see here there are pipes running down to harvest the water which goes further in the storage tanks there is this solar water geyser and then this the natural light system which opens in the main hallway of the house And lovely house this is. Probably has become some sort of a study ground. I don't know what it is. Maybe a sort of a library or something. But a lovely house nevertheless. Now you can have a much appreciation of the entire architecture. Very old construction, no doubt. Given the sort of arrangement and the sort of... Uh, its a composer on this particular cliff. The house seems to be quite symmetrical and there is a very good ventilation system, very good lightning system. Well, well constructed, must be of some heritage value also. Hill mango with the inflorescence. I'll ask these girls what exactly this thing is. Probably they can mention about it. But ye log, ye kya hai? Cement koti. To yahan kya library wagera bhi hai? Nahi nahi yahan kuch nahi hai. Kisi ka ghar hai. Koon rehta yahan par? Jiska hai wo rehte hai? Haan. Okay. So it's called the cement court. It's not any sort of school, though the children were coming out of it <laughs> with school, uh, with uh, study material, but it's not a school. First vehicle to come across.
vehicle parking in the most un un thought of places and the hill cows along the lane another old house is just down there let me show it to you but i'll have to walk there to give you a better appreciation of the place and there i see some beautiful bignonias there you see i'll come to that later but let me first show you this beautiful house okay a lovely pathway slowly dwindling down from here slowly dwindling down and it goes in there to that little lovely house lovely house isn't it and these are the devil's trumpet the devil's trumpet let me show you some bignonias here which are in flowering these days those little flower pots arranged in pt bottles bignonias in this house lovely tree and beautiful tree to, for a site <laughs> these women folk are gathered has just gathered some water from the rani dhara nola you can see them garage ye dfo ka hi ghar hai shayad wo jo lal chhat wala wo dfo ko hai probably ha bagaya let me see what house this is though there isn't any name around but i believe this is often officer the divisional forest officer yeah there it is the house of the divisional forest officer Hmm these are new apart apartments APS apartments Rani Dhara Almora lovely apartments beautiful ones overlooking the entire valley of Almora that seems like a cafe might be i don't know josh jews <laughs> it's a lovely little township with a lot of intricate lanes by lanes appearing here and there and one can assume that people who are taking a stroll around here would be extremely physically fit the day is closing to its end the street lights are on and you can also see lights of the far off villages if the camera works well <laughs> so we are almost at this uh at the what we call the rani dhara nola that is the water point of the rani dhara the rani stream the queen stream it's pretty close by and uh, this is another beautiful old not that old but still fairly old house here yeah. it's though logged no inhabitants here the plight of such houses I pity them. All right, there you see that temple 
and right behind the temple is the Rani Dhara Nola. You can see this gentleman going to gather, collect his water, drinking potable water. Nice walk overall. This is very unfortunate to see. Inconsiderate waste disposal just dumped on the hill slope. And not only here, all across there as well. Very saddening, very saddening to see this. Now, I don't know what's wrong with people. They produce so much of litter, they produce so much of plastic waste and they have the least considerations for its proper disposal. So here we are at a beautiful small Shiv temple, Narmadeshwar Shiv temple with the devil's trumpets. I'm told that they could be used to make some intoxicating drugs. And what is this? Some sort of DC Joshi insurance documents, leave it there. That is the Rani Dhara Nola. People are gathering. Why am I saying gathering repeatedly? People are collecting. They're drinking water from this place. Requests are pretty firm. Avoid parking and washing clothes here. Good. Nola, keep it clean. <laughs> <laughs> 